In a world of political intrigue, meet Samantha Harrison, 2016 Republican candidate for President of the United States. I accept your nomination for President of the United States with equal rights as my goal, platform, and banner. Is America ready for a woman president? Concord was its usually cold place, as it always was in the presidential primary season. If Sam could put up with the snow, the cold, and the brutal directness of New Hampshire residents, she could prove her mettle as a candidate. Follow Samantha's life from love struck in college. Uh, to be honest, I haven't had much time for men, at least until now. They both laughed and their love affair began. To success in business. It was a heady time taking the Concorde to Paris or London, doing a deal over a couple of days and returning the same way. She was dealing with some of the top investment bankers and lawyers in the world. Read about her road to political power. First, as a no-nonsense criminal prosecutor. Reginald Powers is a pathetic man. He is the worst of the parasites that prey on our youth and keep crime on our streets. Find him guilty and let this court send him where he belongs. Then Congresswoman. Her group became known to insiders in Washington as the Harrison Caucus, a collection of powerful Republicans and conservative Democrats who yearned for the kind of presidential bravado so often displayed by Ronald Reagan. And finally, Governor of Virginia, tough on crime. Mr. Vasquez, I imagine you know I am the governor. And I also imagine you know why a governor would visit a man about to be executed. Now, is Samantha Harrison ready to beat Hillary Clinton, the Democrats pick for 2016? Voters agree with me because I speak from my heart and not from a party platform or in lockstep opposition to anything an opposing party might say. But make no mistake, I am a Republican. Can Samantha Harrison balance politics with being a daughter and wife? The presidential candidate felt completely helpless. When her husband needed her most, there was so little she could give. She was just as lost as she had been 48 years before with her father. And a mother? Jeremy, wherever you are, I hope you're fine. I know what you're doing is noble and something you love, but please remember we want you home safely. You don't need to be a hero for anyone. And demands of the most powerful office in the world. Read Presidential Intentions by Douglas J. Wood. A gripping novel of politics, power, and sacrifice. A book that answers the question. Is Samantha Harrison ready to be the first woman president of the United States? Is America ready? Available now on Amazon and elsewhere in print, Kindle, and audio.